Welcome to Moo Moo Math. Today we're going to look at solving two-step equations. So to solve equations with variables on both sides of the equation. So we're going to look at solving with variables on both sides. Now what's a variable? That can be the value x or y or any letter that represents a number. So here's our first example. We have 5x plus 2 is equal to 3x minus 12. Okay, we, to gather our variables, which are 5x and 3x, we can either subtract 3x from both sides of the equation. So I actually like to draw a line right down my equal sign so I can see my two sides. So I can either subtract 3x from both sides or I can subtract uh, 5x from both sides. So I can subtract 3x or subtract 5x um, to move the variables to both sides. I like to keep my variable positive, so I usually take the smaller one, so this is 3x, and I move it over to the 5x. That way I keep my variable positive. So I'm going to draw that, do that first, and I'm going to draw a line, and then I'm just going to add my columns adding columns. So 5x minus 3x, that's 2x. I'm going to bring down my positive 2. Now the next column is 3x minus 3x. Well that's just 0. So I'm going to bring down a 0 minus 12. So if you simplify this, it's actually 2x plus 2 equals and then 0 minus 12 is negative 12. Now, we're going to continue solving this as a regular, in this case, a uh, two-step equation. Okay, so let's do this as a two-step equation. We've got 2x plus 2 equals negative 12. Again, I want to get my, ver my like terms together. So I'm going to bring this 2 over to this side so I can get what we call our constants together. And those are numbers without variables. So I'm going to subtract 2, subtract 2 on either side, and I'm going to bring down, again adding columns, I'm going to bring down my 2x, 2 minus x, that's z or 2 minus 2, that's 0, equals, and then negative 12 minus 2, that's negative 14. So now I've got one more step. I have to get the x by itself. This is 2 times x, so to undo a multiplication, I'm going to divide both sides by x. And I'm left with x is equal to, and then negative 14 divided by 2 is negative 7. So there is my answer. My answer to this equation is negative 7. Now what I want to do is I want to check the answer. I want to go back and check and make sure it works in the original equation. So my original equation is 5x plus 2 is equal to 3x minus 12. So everywhere there's an x, I'm going to plug in this negative 7. So I've got 5 times negative 7 plus 2 equals 3 times negative 7 minus 12. Now if you remember Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. That's PEMDAS, the order of operations. I have to do parentheses first, then exponents, then multiply and divide. So let's multiply and divide left to right. So I have 5 times negative 7 is negative 35. Bring down my positive 2. Equals 3 times negative 7 is negative 21. Bring down this minus 12. Now I want to add and subtract where I can. I can add these together and subtract these. So that's going to be negative 33. And this is going to give me negative 33. And that is true. So I know I have done this correctly. And that's how you can check your work to make sure you've solved the equation correctly. That's how you do. Uh, an equation with variables on both sides.